My name's Julie. I'm a casual primary school teacher in the Illawarra, have been for about 14 years. I go to various schools from various age groups, so I could be in kindergarten one day, year four the next, year five or six the next, and I could be at four or five different schools in one week. So it's been a really interesting foundation to observe kids' behaviours and my own behaviour especially. <laughs> I mean, I've been to various other things here and I thought, yes, I must um, must do this because it's something I have been practising in the classroom for, for the years that I have been teaching. But for me, um, you yeah, know, sometimes being looked at or being, you know, in trouble, sometimes at schools in the past, um, seeing that this is accredited now and that the department is recognising the need for this, for me was a big thing. So to me, it's about... I guess getting the credential for something that I have always believed in anyway because that's the way the world works but um, yeah for me it was about just getting a little bit of paperwork to say this is real this is of value it's not esoteric it's not airy-fairy this is a worthwhile thing that's been finally recognized um, to help children and teachers in schools This workshop in itself is very easily set out or to understand for anyone who's never practiced. There's a little bit of the theory background behind things to get an understanding, but then there's the practical components where you're practicing. And there's a lot of, of uh, sharing of stories of things that have been going on, you know, in people's schools that are already practicing. And I think Catherine has a real um, nice set out of the structure of um, lesson plans and programs and resources that you can pick up and, and take away. I love to see all teachers do this workshop and schools take it on as a whole holistic approach. It's not a religious thing, it's just a, a um, I mean mindfulness is being very present in what we're doing every day, you know, talking to each other eating our food, walking around the school. You know, often you see teachers at lunchtime with their classes, you know, quite flustered. We're going to practice walking around the school because you guys are so noisy. It's just, this is ridiculous. Lunchtime, we're gonna practice, you know. Well, mindful walking could really help that situation. So there's lots of little areas that we can um, bring it into the school without too much interruption to the other reasons why we're there. Ha, ha, ha.